guys, what do you see? And uh, why don't you start by taking us through, sort of the, the take us back to the acquisition. Mm -hmm. what that, what's, what's happened, what happened there, and what happens, what's happened since, and then we'll get into the uh, Hadoop angle. Yes, absolutely. So the, the acquisition was a great thing for us. Um, what happened was that we had, um, you know, Astra was kind of the, the leader in this emerging technology space of big data for the enterprise. Data Data was obviously the leader in, you know, data warehousing, enterprise data warehousing. And so the merger of the two, I think, created a leader in the big data space. So the great thing about us being part of Teradata is that we have a lot of, uh, we have great amount of resources. We've been able to increase the amount of R&D investment that we're doing. We also have access to resources that we didn't have before. For instance, one of the things we did after the acquisition is that we came out with a hardware appliance that fully packages our software on a hardware packaging that's fully supported by Teradata. And that's something would be very hard for us to do, frankly, as an independent company. So we're very actively exploiting synergies between Teradata and Aster in terms of market, in terms of technology, and the amount of resources and support we have is great. Now, what's a, is a, did you plan on dropping Hadoop into that appliance? Is it already there, or what's No, that? so what is that? That's Aster software on an appliance, so it's our software on an appliance packaging, and it also includes management software from Teradata, and it includes an Aster Teradata connector. So if you have a Teradata the warehouse, you can just drop this box, plug it in, and very quickly get up and running, and do ingest new types of data, and move them over to the, your data warehouse,